Hello and welcome. Today in this video, I'm going to explain a little bit more about our category mapping tool, which you have access to whenever you purchase the inventory automation with us. As you can see, I'm managing the specific feed for this specific integration. We're going to scroll down a little bit and on our categories tab, you'll be able to manage and map the categories given to us by the specific supplier. As you can see on the left, we have the specific parent categories from this supplier. You can see the category structure by hitting the plus button right next to the parent category. As you can see the child categories or subcategories within the parent category. We give you a handful of options on how to map out these specific categories. So you can come in and exclude out the parent categories or subcategories that you do not want to sell the products of. You can also replace the category name with the manufacturing name. So instead of this specific subcategory name, it's going to then replace it with the manufacturer name. You can also come in and rename or apply new parent categories uh, to specific parent categories or subcategories. I'm going to explain a little bit more and give you a little example of how this works. So let's say we have CO2, we also have the CO2 pistol and CO2 rifle. We actually want to get rid of these subcategories, put all of these products into the CO2 category and subcategory. So I'm going to go in and rename these specific subcategories to that specific subcategory. Make sure it lines up perfectly with how it looks. And as you, as I said earlier, these specific subcategories will not be there anymore. All of these products will now be under the subcategory CO2. You can also come in and apply new parents to the specific subcategories. So for instance, mag, we actually want that to now be out of the parent category air guns and we want it to be under magazines and for example slingshot we're not sure why that subcategory is under the parent category air gun so we're actually going to make a new parent category for it new parent category will be slingshot you can also come in and um, rename the specific subcategories of parent categories. Maybe it, you just don't like the name of it and you just want to come and rename it. Um, for example, miscellaneous air guns. Um, we can just rename it to miss. We give you these options, you know, just for you to map out the categories, what you see deemed fit. Um, make sure that it's lining up with the categories on your website or sales channel, um, as well as coming in and before we push product data onto your sales channel, you can come in and make sure that these categories are mapped out to how you want them to view for your specific products. As I said in earlier vid videos, you can do a custom price markup for specific parent categories or subcategories. We also also give you the option of being able to load new categories automatically. You can disable that. And as you can see here, we have enabled category specific pricing. That's a little bit more about our category mapping tool and how you want to map out the categories that you see deemed fit for the specific integration.